Youth car seat with the final flight of the Flex Innovations RV860E for the day. The wind is starting to pick up a little bit and change Flat directions. Up. About half this flight, it was directly in my face, so I had to crosswind landing to attempt, which wasn't too bad. Flight mode two. So far, from what I can tell, this plane handles the wind really well. Where I shoot my plane out of there. Some of the next door neighbors were uh, out target practicing with their pistols. <laughs> Sounded a lot closer than it really was. Time remaining five minutes. Flight mode three. I've been practicing blipping my throttle. Seems like everybody in the 3D world does it. Got to be a reason for it. So I'm trying to learn to do that without input and rudder. things I've been working on in the Sims outside knife edge circles pretty cool a little hard to do until you get the uh, directions right I've been using the same thing on my helicopter though time remaining four minutes One of my buddies just bought the Flex Innovation Piranha. We're going to see how that flies this Sunday if uh, everything works out right. He's in a need for speed. He, he flies jets and he likes the fast stuff. Yeah, I think I gotta give him more rudder. Time remaining three minutes. Well, sound like somebody's got a lot of money to spend over there in target practice. <laughs> At a dollar or two around. Take up landing flaps. He's all right shooting over there. We don't hear the time remaining two minutes. Yeah, I kind of changed my mind about landing on this round. Wind started to change directions from south to east to north. <laughs> I just kind of thought I'd play a little hover in the wind.
It went right out of the east, didn't it? At this point, I decided uh, landing flaps is not needed, so I just went to take off flaps, so I didn't glide so far. Take off flaps. Well, this concludes Sunday's flight session. If you want to see more, please like and subscribe. And see y'all next time. Thanks for watching.